So today we're gonna do probably one of the most epic sinking ship survivals we've ever done. This is the MS Sapelo, and we are gonna do two separate sinks. And folks, you wanna stay tuned for the second one because a part of the ship collapses and it's absolutely frightening. So hit that thumbs up button and let's jump in. All right, so we are aboard the Sapelo. We are ready to head out. So this ship is absolutely detailed. One of the most detailed ships I've ever seen on Stormworks. Not the biggest one, but it does have some amazing sinks. So here we are in the bridge. We're gonna go ahead and light everything up. We're gonna go on a little bit of a tour and we have two options uh, for sinks. There is a sink button here in the bridge, which I think this is the really exciting one. And there's another one down in one of the dining sections, uh, which I think we will go ahead and do both of them here this episode. We'll save the exciting one for later though, so stay tuned. All right, so here we are in the engine room. Let's go ahead and do the starters here. Uh, we'll do starboard and we have our uh, port engine. So let's go ahead, oh no, not the reverse. Okay, pumps, uh, we'll go RPS selector. We'll go up on each of those. So that'll uh, spool up the engines. Uh, and then we will hold the clutch in, so there we go. So we still need to do this up in the bridge, but just check this out. There is so much detail down here. Actually, I think there should be some lights. Uh, maybe we can turn those on. Yeah, there's just so much detail down in this engine room and it pretty much just extends all the way through this ship. And yeah, it's just probably one of the most amazing interiors I've ever seen. So here we are back up at the bridge. Let's go ahead and get moving. So let's go port throttle up. Uh, starboard throttles up and we'll turn the clutches. Watch this thing's got some acceleration to it. Uh, it's gonna take it just a second here. And then once it kicks off, it is gonna go and it's gonna be amazing. Oh, here it's pulling up. Oh yeah, get ready for it. Uh, it is gonna take off and it's gonna be amazing. And there it is. Yeah, this thing's got really, really, really good acceleration. All right, so let's go ahead and start to turn. We wanna get out to deep sea for this one. Uh, but yeah, uh, we'll go over a quick tour, go over all the amenities. Uh, this is the J&R ship line uh, here in Stormworks. All the lifeboats do work. Uh, it's actually a really cool system. I, I might actually just launch one just in case I don't get around to it because I think for one of the sinks, we do want to stay aboard because something really exciting happens uh, to the ship. But I'm going to go ahead and launch one just to demonstrate it for you guys because it is uh, a really cool system. So normally it swings out, but this... Actually, if you just do this, it'll, it's on a rail system. So it'll swing out like that instead of doing that awkward kind of like pivot back and forth. And then you can hit this key button here. That'll release it. And then you would just winch down and there's a uh, full controls in the lifeboats. Uh, there's, I think there's a medical kit. Yeah, you've got that. You've got a uh, flare gun in there and you can control it fully, which is really cool. We'll just leave that uh, there. But yeah, we'll start here from the top. Uh, we'll go towards the back. You've got old people games. I forgot what that's called. Somebody can comment down below and answer. Uh, you've got a nice pool in the back. Uh, everything you can go into. There's no dead zones in this ship, at least from what I've seen. So yeah, now this is the back stairwell. There is a main stairwell uh, towards the center of the ship. Uh, we'll go into here. We've got dining sections. Let's go ahead and light these up. And I must say, I love the interior. And also, I'm gonna go ahead and spoil a little bit here. If you're doing the sink from the bridge, stay in the dining room. It is pretty cool. So let's go ahead and here, we'll turn on this light here. Uh, so yeah, uh, nice dining room. I do love the uh, the way the floor has been done. You've got like a little model of the ship here, a little stage. Uh, there is a button here that says, uh, are you ready kids? <laughs> That's one of the sinks by the way. Uh, but yeah, I'm not gonna click that yet. Also, I like the way they made this uh, look like a curtain that's draped over. This uh, leads back into the kitchen area where there is a trash compactor and no folks, you can't stick a human in there. I was thinking that'd be the perfect thing to stick Obi in uh, if he would play with me. I don't think he would trust me around that. Uh, but yeah, uh, we'll go back into here. We've got a mail room and I believe this leads into potentially, yeah, the anchor room. Also, you got a supplies in here, uh, anything that you might think we actually know. Let's go and equip a couple things. I think we might need some of these. And I do like the whole fact that Stormworks now has more inventory slots. Uh, but yeah, that's the main dining room area. We'll go ahead and go back through here. Uh, there are cabins here. Uh, I think we need to go down a level to get to those. Uh, I believe we're on B deck. I could be wrong. Uh, there's little areas in here. You've got like a, looks like a little bookstore. Uh, actually, that's probably like a continuation of it. 
Uh, if I'm not mistaken, I've even seen stuff like, I believe there's like a daycare and stuff in here too. It's pretty cool. So yeah, this is passenger cabins. Uh, it says C, so I'm assuming we're on C deck. Uh, these are all fully detailed. You got bathrooms in them. Uh, they normally all have closets. I've noticed some have bigger closets than others, uh, but it's really cool. Uh, this would be something, if you have like a full crew of people and everybody can handle it in multiplayer, I, I feel like this would be a really, really fun ship to play uh, with. So yeah, you've got that. So, yeah, coming back here, we've got the ship's hospital. There is a morgue in here, and no, the uh, little body warmers don't work. <laughs> I, I kind of want to stick something in there. It's fine. Uh, there is a laundry room somewhere. So I'm not sure if I'm actually where it... I think it might be in the back, actually. Uh, but yeah, you have cargo here. There's cargo below us. And then that'll take you up to the upper hold. Which I think you can also get to the engine areas from this uh, door. Yup, I was actually wrong. Hold on, let's go down the lower hatch. Are we in the engine areas? Oh, my goodness. Uh, we're in the cargo bay. But yeah, this does lead... Eventually to the, oh, that's like a, oh, it's a workshop. That's actually really cool looking. Yeah, this will lead all the way down to the engines. Uh, you've got a fridge here. I'm assuming for all the food supplies. There's a freezer on this side, beverage fridge, and you've got your pantry. All of it is fully detailed. Yeah, this all just swings back around and there's a staircase towards the back of the generators here and this will lead you back up into kind of like the uh, the main areas. But yeah, there's probably gonna be details that I haven't even gone over, but I strongly suggest you guys go download this thing it is pretty cool like oh here's the daycare but yeah there's a lot of stuff on the outside areas and i think there's a barber shop in here too okay komodo is going to try not to run into the creative island here we're going to turn now i'm going to go over one last thing before we hit our sync buttons uh it's actually really really neat so this ship has a lot of safety measures if you were to play and you actually naturally get into trouble like i know something explodes you hit something uh, you've got watertight doors all through here. You've got little uh, gauges that show you how much water you're taking on. And then you've also got, oh, let's turn on the radar and the map. Uh, you've got all the bilge pumps here too, which I'm assuming maybe these light up. I could be wrong. But yeah, uh, it's actually got a lot of safety measures in here. And there's a fire suppressant system in a lot of the ship. Uh, but yeah, very, very awesome a uh, piece of work here in Stormworks. So yeah, first sink of the day. Stay tuned. This isn't the one where we have to stay in the ship. We might actually try to get out on this one. I'm curious about this. So here we go. I'm going to click the button. Three, two, one, and... Oh my goodness. Something just exploded. Okay, let's look at the photo mode real quick to figure out where that explosion was. Uh, I haven't clicked this one yet. I just know it's the more traditional one. I clicked the other one. I did do a little bit of testing with the ship. Uh, typically there's a, oh wait, where is it? Oh, here we go. Uh, yep, there's definitely been an explosion. Uh, a piece of the ship has blown off. And is that, that's not in the engine room. That is actually in the cargo area. Hmm, what kind of cargo was down there? We should probably question that. Uh, you know what? How about we head down that way and see how quickly we're taking on water. Uh, we can always get up and take care of the lifeboats. Engine is still running, so I don't think it's uh, anything to do... Oh, by the way, here's the laundry area. But yeah, I don't think it's anything to do with uh, the engines. It was something in the cargo. Okay, we're going to take a look down here. Uh, we don't know if we need to be alarmed as of yet. Uh, let's go ahead and see. The cargo area is right up here. Uh, a lot of these doors are... Oh, my goodness. That is a ton of water. This is where you would be sealing, which I think these are the watertight doors. I mean, obviously, for reasons, because we're going to sink the ship, I'm not going to seal these. But I really do think you can go up there, or you can have crew members down here close these doors. And you should be able to keep the flooding to this front compartment where the cargo bay is. Now, there is netting up above it that I think it might flood the next compartment up, but I still think you could seal it off. Uh, but you know what? We better go sound the alarms in the bridge and maybe get prepared for a potential evacuation here. All right, so we go public address system. Actually, we should be talking into here. I would probably just say something like, hey, we're going to die. What would you guys say? Comment down below. Actually, what do you think I would actually say? Uh, probably you're going to die. You know, it's fine. All right, let's turn on the uh, lights. Uh, there was emergency lights are on. Uh, we have a fire suppressant system, which I don't actually think we have a fire aboard. There was an explosion but I didn't see fire. Now, I know the other sink. Uh, the ship gets a little toasty on it. Hey, let's go ahead and gather some supplies up here. Uh, I think we are ready to go. We might want to start slowing the ship up. We know we're going down. 
Uh, but I do not want to launch the lifeboats while we're uh, going full speed. The engines are actually okay. Oh my goodness. It's like we just slammed on the brakes there. All right, let's uh, look over the front of the ship. Uh, oh my, that is taking on water a little faster than I thought it was going to. Okay, you know what? Uh, let's go ahead and get those lifeboats ready. Uh, let's go ahead and go out. Uh, you cannot release them from here. Like you have to be inside of them. And I think you have to hit the ropes. I could be wrong. Maybe I missed something. Uh, but let's go ahead and lower them down. Uh, oh my goodness. This, okay, this is really fast. Uh, maybe we should go sail this. Actually, I wonder if we could like stop, like how quickly could we stop this? All right, let's go. Oh, actually, nope, wrong place. That was officer's quarters. By the way, there is a captain's room and everything uh, down below. I actually didn't show that off, but I strongly suggest you guys go download this and check it out. Uh, you can see in here, looks like compartment number four and there's the cargo hold, which that thing is almost all the way flooded. So we would probably seal, actually I'd probably seal the whole ship off if that's what we're doing. All right, let's go general alarms on. Okay, here we go. Uh, send that over. Let's go winch down. Uh, oh, actually key. There we go. All right. Lifeboat is off the side. Make sure it's pretty close to the water line there. I don't want to drop it and okay. Let's go ahead and hop over real quick just to prove to you guys that we can use these things. Uh, also, I want to shoot the flare gun even though it's pointless. I mean, it's day, but I guess you would still probably shoot that off. Where'd it go? What the heck? Okay, we've got... Oh, I can see it. There it is. I was looking for that. Okay, so yeah, we can go over here. And I know we can detach the ropes this way. Oh my goodness, we were a little high there. No, I think we're okay. All right, so we're going to hit the next one. That is so cool looking that you can see into the ship right here. All right, let's go ahead and get rid of that. And then we would want to go to the back controls, uh, set down, and we can throttle out of here. I think it goes this way. There we go. Yeah, these are really, really effective, nice lifeboats. Also, I think the sink might have slowed up a little bit. Like, I definitely think with the engine still running, you could seal those compartments and potentially uh, limp back to shore. Not going to lie, though, that looks really cool. Wait a minute. What is going on? What is going on? Oh, there's a rogue wave here. Oh my goodness. Okay, we just got smacked by the ship. I don't know how it's going to affect the sinking. I thought for a second there a whirlpool was developing. I was like, you've got to be kidding me. Uh oh. Okay, come on. No, 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 no. Go up, go up, go up. Go, 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 go. Oh, I'm actually dying right now. Uh, that's okay. That's not good. Uh, we are under. Oh, geez. Okay, you know what? We got to jump back aboard real quick. I need. Wait, did I grab a medic kit? How come that was one of the things I didn't grab? Okay, we gotta go grab that medic kit. By the way, would you guys like a, uh, a drink at the Gillette Lounge? Uh, this is totally named after Jesse Gillette, which was in the credits for the ship. Uh, very cool looking, nice lounge. Okay, totally going back up to the bridge to go get a, a health kit here, a medic kit, there we go. First aid, all right, we all, uh, we're all good now. Go ahead and fire another flare off for good measure. Boom, there we go. It's weird that you look up and it shoots that way, but that's yeah, good enough. They know we're in trouble out here. Oh, man, look at that. That is awesome looking. It is going down right now. The back end is up in the air. It's starting to twist a little bit. Uh, you can kind of see everything flooding. Uh, wait, did I close this? Yep, I closed the sides here. Uh, this is actually a sealed deck, by the way, which is kind of cool. A lot of times these side decks are open. But, yeah, this one's sealed up. That would be so crazy setting there watching the water line just go above the windows that would freak me out <laughs> but yeah it is starting to accelerate so i'm assuming more and more uh compartments and areas are getting flooded inside of the ship and it is uh not long before she's gonna be resting at the bottom of the ocean oh man there it goes oh that is so cool looking all right uh wait are the main oh man something just broke in the main compartment i didn't realize it did that so the main dining area just blew open. I thought that was only for one of the sinks. So we'll experience that here in a second. Oh, we weren't that deep, were we? Uh, yeah, it's now pointed up out of the, uh, of the water here. No, this is fine. I think it's starting to fall over. So yeah, one of the really neat features, once a certain section gets underwater, this whole dining section collapses. Uh, look at all the panels and stuff. You know what? I think we should actually be inside. We should do the other sink with this. Uh, I actually didn't think it did this. Uh, that was amazing looking. I could see it uh, kind of happen in the background. And you know what? I think we need to experience being aboard this, maybe during a big 
uh, storm and we'll do the other sink which is a little bit more violent all right so we are back moving once again so yeah we're gonna trigger the sink from here and this is gonna be the true survival uh, i'm not quite sure how quickly the inside floods but here we go it says please don't on it well you put the button here so i kind of have to all right so we're gonna click that one boom and we are good to go. oh my goodness that was a what the that was the engine holy man that was a big explosion okay we might want to grab a fire extinguisher uh that was a uh, very 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 violent sounding uh you know hold on let's see i didn't look at the bottom of this last time like i i felt like when i did a, a small test i was like something blew up obviously it's the engine but oh wow oh that was d almost directly in the center and we have a big that is a giant hole look at that uh, that leads all the way through here. Look at the detail in here. Okay, um, yeah, I don't know if the extinguisher is going to be enough. We could activate the fire suppression system. Oh my goodness, it is very toasty here. Uh, oh, oh wow. Okay, I did not realize it was this bad. Uh, I don't think we have a fire suppression system here. No, I think it's all down in the engine. Um, yeah, this is, this isn't good. Is there any, wait, do they have hose hookups? No, there's a bunch of extinguishers. I wasn't sure if there was maybe a hose hookup. Uh, maybe we could try to fight the fire that way. This is... Oh, this is useless. Uh, okay, that's bad. So we're taking on water basically from the center of the ship. Uh, we could potentially get down towards the engine room. Just kind of look at what it looks like down there. Uh, I don't know how bad it is. Oh, my... Oh, okay. No, 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 no. That is bad. Holy man. Dude, that's the water it's already down there it's flooded the whole engine okay let's go ahead and seal that up there that might stop it for a little bit why do i hear a siren going off that's probably not good okay we need to go into the dining hall here this is where we want to be uh when this all goes down um i don't know how quickly like you would think if it blows out all the windows and this all collapses uh it's gonna sink really quick uh wait should we go grab one of those uh little uh do, wait do we have any di no we don't have diving equipment but we have the little air uh little system that we can grab up at the bridge okay so oxygen mask we have one of those i would say we're allowed to use that i mean it's in the arsenal and what is is it the wait are we gonna volcano what is that going off for uh look around okay we're not wait tsunami no uh oh my goodness there is a tsunami behind us uh it is really far out though um, I'm hoping it dissipates before we get here. We're not here for the tsunami. Uh, this thing does a good job at sinking itself. Okay, so we are back here. We got the oxygen mask. Uh, so we'll be able to last a little bit in here. Man, I don't know what to expect. This is pretty crazy, huh? Can we see the water line? It hasn't quite made it to this window yet, but man, the ship is just burning. All right, we're gonna get a view of it. Yeah, it is glowing and it is definitely starting to tilt back. Uh, the engines are running though so it hasn't completely like blown it apart you know just as i say that the engines sound like they're cutting off uh-oh um okay you can hear that sound of the engine struggling um no this is great wait is that water is that actually to the hold on open up the dining hall is that okay i thought there was wait is there water down there uh, okay, water hasn't made it to the bottom of this stairwell yet. There is um, got to be a million leaks there, though. I mean, that thing is destroyed. Uh, I wonder if we can go down further on the other side to see if there's water getting it. What was that sound? Uh, hey, it sounds like the engine's trying to refire. Okay, so I'm looking out. I don't see the tsunami. I, I feel like it actually dissipated. The sirens are on. Either that or we got away from them. Um, I think we're good. It's just, it's all about waiting in here. This is, whew. This is scary. Okay. Oh, I was going for a status check. Well, we, uh, the uh, the fire is actually getting extinguished right now, but there is water rapidly rising uh, through the back section of the ship. That's uh, okay. Time to lock ourselves down. I think. Hey, okay, we got it closed off. Oh, let's look up towards the top. Oh my goodness. I mean, I don't know why I'm so excited for this, but I really want to see this thing fall apart. I think I've only been in one other ship that fell apart from the inside. If I'm not mistaken, there was a big cruise ship we checked out. And I think one of the elevators actually collapsed. Uh, but wait, is that water up in the second deck? And that already looks like it's up there. We're really far down. Uh-oh. Is it going to tip up? 
Oh, man. Oh, it's starting to... Oh, yep. It's definitely tipping up right now. Okay, I hope this little oxygen mask works pretty good. Because... Oh, you can see the water going over the top there. Oh, it's only going to be a matter of time before the weight collapses down. And this whole thing is going to give out... Oh, my goodness. Oh, that is cool looking. Holy man. Uh, oh, that... Okay, that's quick. Go, 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 go. Go, 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 go. Go, run up this. On. Get the door open. Get the door open. Ah, can we get through here? Uh, oh my goodness, that water's just rushing up. Okay, uh, we're up in the mail room. Oh, we are tipping up. Uh-oh. Uh-oh. Wait. Hold on, I think we're good. Wait. Oh, jeez. Okay, stay up. Stay up. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh, no, no, no. Okay, we do not. Okay, we gotta go. Uh, okay, go up through here. Uh, the water is... Dude, it's chasing us. Okay, uh, please tell me, is this a, wait, store hat? Oh, wait, there's water in here. Wait, no, no, no. <gasps> You've gotta be kidding, wait. No way. We didn't just get that lucky. Dude, that water was literally chasing us and we were able to get out the top. Thankfully, there was a hatch there. That is so cool. Man, that, that was epic. I thought we were dead. Like, I thought maybe for a second we would hit bottom and maybe it would stop uh, taking on water and it would just kind of get stuck. But no, it was definitely taking on a lot of water. But we were able to actually uh, use the top to our advantage. 